What's going on guys? I'm back again. I have a, a new sauce to try. Uh, this comes from my uh, good friend Dan Lowenstein. It is Tame the Reaper. You guys can see that. It is uh, by uh, Red Hawk Premium Peppers. And you can find this sauce if you go to www.redhawkpeppers.com. You can uh, find the sauce on there. Pretty reasonable price, I believe. It's like ten dollars or under, something like that. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and get right into it. Uh, Dan was nice enough to uh, go ahead and send this to me. Uh, got a couple other other ones from him to try. But uh, go ahead and tell you what's in this. It's, uh, some uh, cranberry juice, oranges, uh, reapers assorted, uh, scorpion peppers, uh, orange juice. Wildflower, honey, strawberry preserves, spices, citric acid, and kosher salt um, is in this. So let's go ahead and open it up. We'll find out what it's all about. Man, I can see the flakes peppers in there. That's not going to be good. Tons of pepper flakes in there. So, uh, bits of peppers. So, I'm, I'm assuming this is going to be quite hot. Tame the Reaper. And, uh, it's got scorpions in there, but the main pepper is the Reaper. So, I'm expecting the Reaper being as sweet as it is, as it is, I can't even speak today. As it is, um, I'm expecting this to be pretty sweet with the uh, oranges and cranberry juice and strawberry preserve and wildflower honey. I'm expecting it to be a, a sweet sauce. Rock that, I smell peppers, man. Holy smokes. Um, and I smell honey, actually. Honeys and pepper. Wow. Oh man. This is going to be hot. So, I'm get the spoon. Alright, here we go. Very sweet right off the bat. Tasty honey. The aftertaste of the honey. Some of the strawberry. Immediately uh, burn across the tongue. And of course the hiccups. Um, ears are already <laughs> hurting. Wow. Faces feels real flush. Very sweet. <laughs> Very sweet sauce uh, no vinegar in this so it's a root base uh, I'm trying to get this under control here for a minute um, it's definitely have a, a good aftertaste of the honey which is nice uh, if you like honey I love honey it's uh, nice and different uh, the bringing out the sweetness and it's with the honey uh, smelt the peppers but once I tasted it didn't taste the the flavors of pepper too bad but heat wise was there automatically tasted a lot of sweetness with the uh, <coughs> juices and the honey and uh it's good sauce good sauce um I think you could use this being as sweet as it is, pretty much any kind of, I don't know if I'd use it on fish, but any kind of other land animal, chicken, beef, pork, uh, would be great marinated or great as, as, a, as a sauce on the side for, uh, for meats, even, you know, uh, glazing a little bit on, on some beef with the honey and all that should car caramelize. 
do really well. Um, whew, I think the hiccups are going away. Um, but uh, typical with the Reaper and the Scorpions, move towards the back a little bit. And there, there's some heat in the back of the throat. Nothing that's gonna, you know, where you're not gonna be able to enjoy this sauce. Um, you know, I would not call this a novelty. This is something you could actually use. It's got good heat to it, a lot of sweetness. So, um, you know, I would even compare it close to like a uh, like a wine style sweet sauce. You know, you could you could put it on all kinds of things: pork, chicken, beef. Um, and uh, has a very um, I don't say Caribbean, but Hawaiian type type sweetness to it. Um, minus the pineapple, but you know, with all the other other, other juices going on in it, uh, I'd say uh, I like this a lot. Uh, like I said, don't get me wrong, it's got a lot of heat to it. Um, you know, when my ears start kind of hurting a little bit, and that tells me it's 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 got some some power to it. And the weird thing is now. Um, you know, I have, the heat's moved up, it's moved from, from, you know, top of the tongue no more now, moved to the back of the throat, and now it's kind of along my lips. Um, but, uh, overall, it doesn't have a bad aftertaste at all. Some sauces that leave, you know, some funky aftertaste. This is, uh, very sweet to the pop, boom, hits you in the mouth, um, honey right off the bat, you taste. Other than that, um, it's, uh, pretty good, man. Thanks, Dan. Appreciate it. So if you guys are interested, I'll get you a close-up shot. This to focus a little bit. Cool label. It's got a little skeleton hands holding a Reaper pod. Uh, if you guys are interested, like I said, uh, hit Dan up at www.redhawkpremiumpeppers.com and Dan will take care of you. Very cool guy. Um, loves wild chilies and makes a bunch of other great sauces so you know there's something that intimidates you um uh, he's got a ton of other sauces available that uh pretty much uh you know whatever floats your boat he's he's pretty got it, pretty got it covered in that in that uh category all right guys i appreciate it have a good one have an excellent day and see you in the next video all right bye bye